more I travel and the more I talk to people just like you, the more I'm finding out that as this world changes faster and faster with the velocity only increasing, the more people want to know what are the rock solid, non-negotiable principles that will never change, no matter whether it's technology, demographics, or what have you. And I think the Pittsburgh Steelers are a great example of that uh, with respect to what I've identified as four pillars uh, that help create this legacy forged in steel. And the first pillar is stability. Number one is stability because this is a franchise that has been in the Rooney family since 1933. Legend has it that the founder, Art Rooney, who was a, a guy who liked to play the ponies, uh, won a bet at the track and used the winnings to spend the $2,500 for the franchise fee that got the team started in the first place. So dating back to 1933, the Rooney family has been an example of stability and stewardship. They've only had three head coaches since 1969. When Chuck Knoll came on board, everything changed, followed by Bill Cower and now today's coach, Mike Tomlin, who, uh, you know, has helped create and sustain this legacy of achievement and success as the Pittsburgh Steelers battle for playoff positioning here in Buffalo, New York today. In fact, the Steelers since 69 have made the playoffs on no fewer than 24 occasions. So if you're looking to create legacy, start above all with a sense of stability and long-term vision. It's about the process, not the prize. Steelers have always been about fundamentals. The other team can't score if they don't have the ball, which is why, since Chuck Knoll became coach in 69, the Steelers have had a tremendous focus on playing great defense, being able to run the ball, chew up the clock. Think about the fundamentals that are applicable to your business or your career. Maybe it's measurement, maybe it's preparation, maybe it's repetition, but for Pittsburgh, fundamentals mean great defense and being able to control the ball on the ground. And number three, while we're at it, let's talk teamwork. The Steelers created legacy through teamwork and by rejecting the cult of personality. In Pittsburgh, no one player is bigger than the rest of the team. So in the NFL, for example, you've had superstars like John Elway, like Lawrence Taylor, like Tom Brady, Peyton Manning, but in Pittsburgh, there's been no one that stands head and shoulders above everyone else, and everyone is expected to earn their dues. Um, so for example, some of the stars behind us today, like Antonio Brown and James Harrison, had very humble beginnings on things like special teams, because in Pittsburgh, it's all about teamwork, and the whole is always greater than the sum of its parts. Number four on the list is self-awareness. I've been a Pittsburgh Steelers fan since the days of Franco Harris and the Immaculate Reception in 1972. And one thing about the Steelers these past five decades or so, they absolutely know who they are and who their customers are. Absolutely, it's a team built on blue collar work ethic. And consequently, the Steelers uh, have been able to enjoy unusually high levels of loyalty, respect, and profitability because they know who they are. They don't go for the flashy players who date supermodels or uh, appear in the tabloids. No, this is a lunch bucket brigade built on a blue collar work ethic and consequently they reject all forms of pretentiousness. I mean, after all, the Steelers don't even have cheerleaders, one of the few NFL teams uh, to not 
go for the sideshows, but more to the things we've talked about, those four pillars of stability, fundamentals, teamwork, and self-awareness. Four pillars that hopefully inspire you to think about ways you can forge your own legacy built on steel to help you recreate and reimagine the business, the brand, the career that you deserve.